Was Michael Jackson really innocent this whole time? Since his death, Michael's name has been dragged through the mud. With allegations, lawsuits, and documentaries where people are accusing him of doing sickening things. However, Michael's old bodyguard and close friend, Matt Fidesz, who spent years with Michael, has recently claimed that this was all nonsense. I know the man behind the mask, because I was with that guy for 10 years. And that just before his death, Michael was close to exposing something that would have blown all of the accusations to pieces. He says he was going to expose something. Do you know what it was? Basically, all the kids' stuff would have been blown to pieces. The crazy thing is, Matt claims that this information could still get released by one of his friends or family. That might still happen. It just takes a certain someone to um, speak out. He even claims that he himself has evidence on his phone of Michael's innocence. And this is a guy who spent years as Michael's right-hand man. I've got videos of pictures, James, that I could release to the media, which will kill that off. Matt said that Michael was heavily into women and would often have secret girlfriends. This guy's got women coming in and out all over the place, kissing on the back of the limo. However, from being a child, the record labels told him to hide his relationships, to avoid upsetting fans, and to make his life a complete mystery. Many seem to be split on how honest this man actually is. Is he lying and simply covering up for his good friend? Or do you think that there's some truth in that Michael Jackson could have been totally innocent?